Although snakes might be one of the most lethal predators in the wild, and they almost always win when they target a prey, they sometimes pick on the wrong opponent. When was the last time you saw an alligator or even a bunny take on a snake? If you'd like to see some wild animals give snakes a run for their money in a fight, keep watching this video as we bring you 15 times where snakes messed with the wrong animals. Number 15. Mongoose vs. Snake there are very few animals in the wild that can pose a threat to black mambas. One of them is the slender mongoose, getting ready to fight it. They both might look small in the ring, but they are two of the most dangerous predators on Earth. The mongoose is a fast animal with very sharp claws. However, a single bite from a mamba could kill up to 15 people. What would a 5-pound mongoose do in this situation? The mamba is dangerous, but it is not a very vicious animal. Its venom makes her prey weak and unable to move. Its toxins and snake venom attach to chemical receptors in the bodies of its victims, messing with communication between nerves and muscles. But because the mongoose's receptors have adapted, its venom is unable to penetrate, thus having no effect on their muscles. Muscles. To tire out its prey, the mongoose dances circles around it. The last shot is a killer. With one snap, the snake's spine is torn off from the back of the head. Even though the snake isn't dead, it can't move. For the mongoose, the reward is worth the risk, and a 7-foot snake is a good meal for the small predator. In Kruger National Park, a dwarf mongoose battles a black mamba, a very dangerous enemy. Mamba snakes, which can grow up to 4.5 meters long, are Africa's most feared animal. Their bite is called the kiss of death because people die of it. It seems like the mongoose was trying to prevent the snake from touching its burrow. Mongooses usually eat rats, birds, and snakes, but this huge black mamba is not your typical everyday meal. This pet mongoose finds a Cape Cobra in its home and fights it. Since the mongoose kills snakes, the cobra must run away as soon as it can. But first, it has to get past the mongoose. The cobra runs away as soon as it gets outside and heads for an open field. But the mongoose is determined to catch up with it and tries to trick it. Here's a mongoose taking on a massive cobra, with the snake constantly trying to bite the mongoose. It is quite scary. The mongoose makes a run for it, and I'm not certain the snake hits a final strike in the presence of gathering spectators. In the middle of the road, an aggressive mongoose battles a confused cobra. The cobra doesn't know how to get away, and the mongoose emerges victorious yet again. Number 14. Honey Badger vs. Snake A honey badger deals with a cape cobra in its way. It chases after it, kills it, and eats it. This is easy to understand. This is not a honey badger, but another kind of badger, probably an American or European badger that has killed a rattlesnake. Badgers seem to be tough regardless of where in the world they come from. Even though the most snake is not poisonous, it is a powerful constrictor that can give painful bites that can be life-threatening if they get infected. Watch how the honey badger deals with the snake. The snake is headed straight for the badger's head. While other animals might run away to find easier prey, the honey badger acts as if it were any other situation and charges in head first, despite the circumstances. Despite the snake's attempt to escape, the honey badger will not let go of its prey until it has crushed it to death. It's game over and time for the badger to eat when it manages to paralyze the snake's jaws. In a matter of seconds, this badger rushes at the snake and destroys it. The badger is knocked unconscious because it had been bitten during the battle and venom is discharged, and a few hours later, it wakes up to order room service. Number 13. Turkey vs. Snake this turkey stops by the roadside to eat what looks like a snake. The snake isn't totally dead yet, but it will be soon. The turkey looks like it's having fun, and he's given the snake an unforgettable ride. This female turkey gets more than she asked for when she comes across a gopher snake. The puffed-up male turkey who appears indifferent to the snake or the female turkey is even more hilarious. This turkey kills a rattlesnake and starts to eat parts of it. I find it quite surprising that turkeys could kill snakes and have such a good time eating them. Number 12. Cat vs. Snake when this large cobra comes close to this cat, it appears to be scared. How could anyone not be? The snake tries and surprisingly fails to strike it, and it decides to run away. 
Nomadic tribes worship the sand cat, and the Prophet Muhammad is reported to have been friendly with them. When the horn viper spots the snake, it has no option but to attack it. The viper has a shot at survival if it's able to bite the cat, but the cat keeps tapping the snake's head over and over again. The snake can't bite the cat because its claws are in the way. The fight lasts a long time and it is quite tough until the final blow. We can see the snake's wounds in this close-up, so it's safe to say that we already know who won the battle. Number 11. Bunny vs. Snake When this bunny jumps on this snake to teach it a thing or two, it's not messing around. The snake tries to run away, but the bunny follows it. To keep things interesting, the rabbit does a backflip and some big kick combos. When this snake makes the bunny bounce and somersault all over the place, it's a show to remember. The bunny doesn't fear the snake, so it chases it until the snake can't take it anymore and scurries up a tree to get away from the crazy rabbit. Number 10. Hen vs. Snake This hen is being attacked by three cobras, yet it does not flee. She pecks at the snakes and stands up for a little moment, showing the chicks, but the snakes just hang out. Take a look at how this hen defends her young against a very hungry cobra. While fighting off the snake, the hen directs her chicks away from the deadly predator. To keep the snake from approaching them, it is up to the chicks. After realizing that this mama hen shouldn't have been messed with, the snake slithers away. This hen almost chews the snake's heads off when it pokes its head into the area where the hen is hiding her eggs. The snake doesn't want to scare the hen, so she stays in the box, prepared for the next attack. This cobra ambushes this hen and her chicks, but the hen fights back hard until all of the chicks get away. The cobra goes after the chicks, but the hen stands in the way of the snake to protect the chicks from being eaten. Number 9. Old Man vs. Snake a gorgeous eastern Australian brown snake, the second most dangerous in Australia, had just slithered by these people on the beach and crawled up to the concrete wall and onto the food serving area close to the beach when this elderly man shows up and gives this snake a kick straight in the face on his way to the bathroom. I know that if I saw a snake, I would just run away instead of kicking it. Australians are just probably accustomed to having snakes get in their way, like a stray cat would be elsewhere. Number 8. Praying Mantis vs. Snake Have you ever thought of how a battle between a snake and a praying mantis would turn out? Take a look at what happens when the snake attempts to attack the mantis. The mantis waits for the perfect time, then latches onto the snake and bites into its flesh. The mantis has its raptorial legs around the snake, so it can't move. The mantis practically continues to eat the snake alive as it keeps biting it. In the next video, you can see that the mantis always adopts the same approach when in a fight with a snake. It attacks the snake, holds it down with its raptor-like legs, and starts chewing on it. The snake is unable to fight back. I never expected to see a snake so helpless in the face of a little insect. They have no choice but to battle because they are trapped in a small bowl. When the clip ends, the fight looks like it could go either way, with no clear winner. To add even more intrigue to an already exciting contest, a second mantis snake team is introduced to an aquarium. The two mantises lose some of their limbs in the battle, and when the snakes are taken away, the two companions begin to attack each other, showing us that they were never friends to begin with. And one of the mantis eats the other one. This mantis sneaks up on a snake, using its raptor-like legs to hold it down before biting into it and slowly ripping flesh off the snake's body. Number 7. Kangaroo Rat vs. Snake while a deadly predator waits in the sand for an opportunity to strike, its prey manages to get away. Sidewinder rattlesnake assaults are easily repelled by desert kangaroos, rats, strong kicks, and high-flying jumps. Scientists are studying how kangaroo rats survive in the wild. Using high-speed cameras, they found that kangaroo rats can often hear ambush attacks coming because their ears are so sensitive. In split seconds, the kangaroo rats protect itself by twisting its body and jumping to dodge the snake's fangs. Even if the rattlesnake touches the rat, the rat might be able to get away if it moves before the snake injects its venom. It kicks the snake away in midair with its back legs, then rides on its long tail to land on its feet. The kangaroo rat then runs away quickly, hoping to stay alive one more day. The kangaroo rat feels safer when it's dark because it can hide from predators and look for seeds, which are its main source of food and water in the hostile California desert, although it is not 100% safe. This kangaroo rat is like a spring-loaded ninja when it comes to avoiding these deadly fangs, and it's not by accident. 
These rats have a habit of frequently doing this. It's inevitable that the rats will lose some battles because you can't always win. Number 6. Secretary Bird vs. Snake no, this secretary bird isn't practicing the newest dance routine from a famous Broadway show. It's squaring up against a snake. These birds kill snakes, even poisonous ones like cobras and black mambas. They always just seem to be in the right place at the right time and know how to take advantage of it. This secretary bird sees a beautiful cobra and moves towards it, while thinking of the best way to deal with the serpent. The plan is simple, trample on it until it's dead and soft and ready to eat. A snake is being dealt with by another secretary bird. This is a great bird to have as a pet if you live in a snake-infested environment, but let's hope it doesn't attack you too. The secretary bird is a big bird of prey that looks like a hawk and an eagle had a baby. In the African grasslands, they are famous for being able to kill snakes. Snakes and other prey are killed by stomping on them and then pecking them in the back of the neck, just the way this secretary bird does to this snake. Number 5. Alligator vs. Snake Burmese pythons are an invasive species from Southeast Asia that has made its home in the Florida Everglades. As top predators, these huge snakes contend with American alligators. These two major predators are fighting over the same resources for the very first time. Large alligators have a huge edge over pythons due to their incredibly strong jaws. The alligator holds the python with about 2,000 pounds per square inch of force. The snake will almost certainly not be able to escape. After a long and difficult fight, something unexpected happens. The alligator gives up. There have been a few instances in which a Burmese python successfully scared an alligator away, and this is one of them. Here's what an underwater fight between an alligator and a python looks like. As seen in this video, when the alligator snatches the snake in its mouth, it looks like it has the upper hand. But that doesn't last long because the snake manages to get away. Number 4. Eagle vs. Snake Birds of prey is indeed a good way to describe eagles. Look at how easily this eagle glides over water and grabs a snake. How did the eagle realize that the snake was close by? The eagle's strong talons hold the snake in place as it flies off to its nest. In a park, an eagle descends on a snake and stabs it with its talons. The snake doesn't seem to be able to get away from the eagle and it seems to be dying slowly. This eagle grabs a few bites of meat off this snake's body, and even though the snake is still moving, Moving, it won't be for much longer. A big eagle catches another snake in its talons and repeatedly bites the snake while holding it down firmly. The snake's mouth is open and it looks like it's calling out for its mother. Number 3. Lion vs. Spitting Cobra the term spitting cobra refers to a variety of cobra species that can discharge or spew venom from their mouth to ward off predators. Take a look at this snake and how it's spitting out the poison in this example against a brave lion. Instead of spitting venom, as it's commonly believed, these snakes spray it by tightening their muscles against the venom glands and forcing the venom out of the fangs front holes. All spitting cobras, regardless of how they usually defend themselves, are capable of biting and injecting venom. Number 2. Meerkat vs. Snake Desert survival is still a long way off for these five-week-old meerkat pups. The closest river hasn't flown in for a very long time, and the land is dried up. Finding food is the most difficult endeavor as the majority of it is buried underneath the scorching dirt. As long as the adults are on the watch for potential threats, the pups can begin their education without fear. First of all, digging is harder than it looks. An adult can dig up its own mass every few seconds, but a pup will require the help of an adult to get the job done. Not all of the free stuff is good for a simple dinner. When an adult scorpion is found, its stinger is gone, but its pincers are still working. In the African desert, it is really important to know how to deal with dangerous animals. It's time for a break and the meerkat really needs some shade, but they still have to finish their lessons. A little meerkat finds itself confronted by a cape cobra. Alone, it's in a lot of trouble, but the rest of the family comes rushing when they hear of it. Learning how to deal with a poisonous cobra is one of the most crucial lessons this young meerkat needs. The whole family will be at great risk if the snake doesn't leave their home. The pups have found a way to stay alive in this dangerous place. Now all they have to do is work together. This meerkat family has found a snake in their territory and doesn't know how to handle things. They tease the snake a few times, but nothing definite happens. They're fascinated, but neither the meerkats nor the snake attack each other. Sentinels watch the skies and grounds for potential threats. When they all cooperate, they can scare off even the deadliest animals that can kill them. 
Like a cobra, they stay far away enough until the cobra eventually realizes that it is outmatched and goes away. Number 1. Snake Eats Itself This king snake becomes really hungry and puts the first thing in its mouth, its own tail. Take a look at this snake trying to eat itself, but it is being saved from self-destruction by this considerate man. I've always known snakes were incredibly dangerous predators, but this list shows that they're far from being untouchable, and a few animals are quite a match for them. My favorite is definitely the brave hens giving the cobras a really good fight. Alright, comment down below what you want to see next. Remember to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to Wildly for more. See you in the next one.